Seed Catalogs to Craft Project. Memories of my mom. I looked through the internet to find images of seed packs that reminded me of my mom. I purchased some off of Etsy as a downloadable file. They're very inexpensive. And I also found some on the internet. My mom would go through that catalog like it was a toy catalog. She was in seventh heaven when that seed catalog came in the mail. These images are four by six. You're going to want to use a laser printer so that the ink does not smear. Cut your boards the same size as the images. A little bit extra hanging off the edge is just fine. Use the orbital sander to take the edge off that board. You don't want it to be sharp. You want it to be nice and smooth. Round those corners just like you would any other scrap of wood. These are just scraps of wood, so they are stained or painted. Either way, it doesn't matter. You're gonna take the DIY liquid patina and you're gonna apply a liberal coat to the block. You don't want any drips or runs, just a nice smooth coat of the liquid patina. Then also put a layer on, just a thin layer onto the photo of the seed pack. Adhere the two together. Smooth down the paper. There might be some bubbles, just push those out, push them out to the edge and hold down the sides of that paint of that photo to make sure that it is here adhering to each other. When my mom got sick, we took turns taking care of her. And one thing she always wanted was she wanted us to bring in whatever new flower was blooming for the day or for the week. After about three to five minutes, you're gonna see some bubbles that form. Just pick your block of wood back up again and push those bubbles down. You can usually get them to suck back down and stick, so you shouldn't have any bubbles. Using your sander, go around the edges. You're removing that white border. Do you have a favorite flower? Mine's the tulip. Now we're gonna seal them with Big Top. Big Top is a DIY product and it's a clear sealer. It's very durable and it has a matte finish. After my mom died, I got to love flowers and I got to experience what she felt when she would open up that seed catalog. To make these look vintagey, I'm applying the DIY dark wax. It goes on with a brush. You just need a little bit. I put it pretty liberal on the brush and seal up my edges first using the majority of the dark wax on those edges. Then you're going to use the remainder on the face of it to make that seed pack vintage. Using a soft cloth, buff some of it back. If you like this YouTube video, please hit the like button and subscribe so that you can see more of The Painted Photographer. If you're local, I sell my product at Tees Tanning Plus Gifts on Main, which I will link below. Thank you for joining me. Make sure you Subscribe. <laughs> if you like this YouTube video, uh, why do I keep having that in my hand? How to make seed packs. It's upside down. <laughs> Take three. Take three. said that <laughs> I'd <laughs> this and uh... until next time happy painting